Hello my beautiful soul, welcome to a new reading, a tarot reading meant to reach you right in this moment. This is a timeless reading available anytime you will come across it. Let's choose our zodiac signs for this reading and we have Capricorn, we have Leo, all right, and two more. We have Gemini, all right. And one more is Cancer. All right. So let's see. Let's see. Let's see what the cards want you to know right in this moment. Something that you need to hear right now. Guidance for you. Gemini, Leo, Capricorn and Cancer. A choice that will bring whoo, great, great success here for you. Either is a business idea, either is a job, either is both. You will make it all by yourself. Nine of Pentacles. All right, that's that's a great first sign. But I would like to choose the cards for this reading. So, what we need to see now? First card. Ooh, Queen of Pentacles. Queen of Pentacles. Next. Seven of Swords. The Lovers. Middle of your reading. The Hermit. And this is the last one from this deck. Ace of Cups. Okay. Two of Swords. Someone here trying to decide something and the lovers, another card of, of choice, of making a decision. What should I do? What should I choose? Am I doing the right thing? Follow your heart. Make choices from the heart. Follow your heart rather than trying to make others happy. You are overanalyzing a situation here. If you made up your mind on something, go with it. Don't, don't turn it upside down. Don't try to find, almost like you try to convince yourself to don't do that. M you made a decision, go with it. Go with it. You know, stop being in this questioning mode. Continue. You don't have to. You don't have a reason why. Now, you have the ability of making anything that you put your mind into beautiful. It will be all right. Now, of course, Seven of Swords, doing some things only you know about. Not everyone needs to know. Not everyone needs to know your thoughts, what you are aiming for, and so on. You know, the most important is if you know, what do you want to do? What is the goal? That's enough. It's more than enough. And now it's, you know, once you have an idea, you decide that, I don't know, you want to go along with a certain idea. Either it's about your work, about your life, whatever it is. Then in order like that to, to come true, is by you making something, taking action, being practical, you know, planning, thinking. Ace of Cups. The Ace of Cups is the card which comes with a great gift. Can be a new job, can be a new home, can be a great, great um message coming toward you that will change everything you will be and you know i got this feeling like you attract this it's not like it's because of something that you do you know the hermit give yourself some time all by yourself to figure things out you cannot involve nobody in this you need to come up again. Look at these, the lovers again. And the six of wands, the card of success. So there is something here that you need to, to think about. 
right? And um, you cannot involve nobody in this. It's like the first, the first step is you with yourself to, to come up with a plan to develop an idea. And then, of course, if let's say it's a business idea, you might have to talk with some people that have more experience that can help you with what's necessary. But you know what I mean? Nobody can, don't let nobody to get involved in your business, in your ideas, how you want to do certain things. Because then, um, you know, y you might lose the, 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 your main idea because of others' opinions or fears and doubts will convince you to give up on something that you feel so strong in your heart that you should do. Now, I mean, the Queen of Pentacles, she's creating the life that she wants. She's powerful, she's resourceful, she has what she needs and she will find even more by just doing her own thing, you know? Now, let's see what else. You have here the Hierophant, a page of pentacles in reverse. So you see, again, that idea of adv getting advice from someone who has more experience. The page of pentacles in reverse shows that a uh, lack of experience, but there is someone that you can talk with. There is, if you look for, you will find the help that you need, the support that you need. Now we have the devil here showing your escape, your liberation, liberation from, from a certain um, uh, place where you've been for way too long and you lost yourself into. Now is the time when you just break free from this and you change your life in a wonderful, wonderful way by detaching yourself from um, a specific or limiting beliefs or bad behaviors or people or situations that were just not helping you anyway. Um, the death card. Now, the death card, the death card is showing the end, right? The death card is the great transformation, the end of a certain period in your life, a certain phase, and going into the next things. So, the end means a new beginning, a new phase here. And this is a, a transition that cannot be avoided, all right? The death card is like here telling you, you may try to stop it, but is coming anyway this end. So what you can do? Prepare yourself. I, I see the hierophant here. It's like prepare yourself. Someone here can help you in front of this big change in your life. There is someone here that can help you. So... Think about the people that you know. Um, try to find, um, you know, to make maybe new connections. You find someone here very helpful. Very helpful. And you have the hermit twice in your reading. Now the hermit, seeking wisdom, right? Taking the time on your own. Um, discovering uh, what is it that you want to do. And then also the hermit is guidance, right? Uh, or finding a mentor, someone that can guide you through this big change in your life. But no matter what, no matter who you find and how experienced they are and so on, the most important thing is here. Everything has to start. The final decision, you should have it. The high priestess here says loud and clear, trust your inner voice. Trust yourself because there is no one else that knows better than you what you want to do next. That's why the lovers was the, giving the same message to make choices from the heart, to listen to yourself, give yourself time to reflect, to, to you know, put your thoughts on paper and decide 
what's the next thing and then look for resources for guidance for people that can help you to really make the bring this idea to reality now let's take this beautiful oracle deck and find out a little bit more for you let's see what we have we have the altar priestess preparation prayer look at this look at this how focused she is um, on this beautiful star that's great shows the focus right shows um, how um, determined you will be to make a dream come true to bring an idea to your reality look at this the chess queen trust and strategizing making plans making plans and with the seven uh, of swords is is the same the a card of strategy right doing something that nobody knows maybe or not so many people know very important your next card is the phoenix what is with all this preparation and trying to manifest something you are in a full process of change here look at this all this detachment from what hold you back once is because you make a choice the choice of your rebirth of changing your life of starting maybe from zero and this time you are more strategic this time you will not let anyone to interfere in your plans in your ideas no one it's it's like you want to do your own thing now you see things clearly now you have that you know um experience life experience and you can do whatever you want to do and you will not another thing here is with the attachment card is like you will be very careful from now on on what you will um not attach like you will be more careful to don't be depending dependent on nobody you know to just do your own thing rely on yourself and nothing else being very focused on your goals and really um, putting your heart and soul into those uh, goals that you have um, not expecting like someone to come in and save you you know so very um, a very independent energy here so my beautiful soul definitely definitely there is a great transformation for you here great transformation and remember have patience and your intuition is everything always do as it feels right for you this is what i have for you in this moment thank you so much for being here with me please don't forget to like to comment to subscribe to the channel i wish you all the best and can't wait to see you next time love and light